Hi, I'm Manoj Kumar. Uh, I'm the co-founder and CEO of Social Alpha and a senior advisor to Tata Trust focusing on innovation, entrepreneurship and R&D. Uh, it's my privilege to uh, visit Hobli to attend Development Dialogues. I really thank organizers for inviting me and it was great that we could enter into an MOU with uh, Sandbox and look, looking forward to working together. Uh, I quite like the format. I think uh, the two days is just, just right. It should not be more or less than that. Uh, but more importantly, uh, you know, this Pandey Foundation in Hubli has created a very robust and powerful infrastructure and ecosystem to give confidence to social entrepreneurs in India that they can get access to resources they need in order to create social impact. I think if we can create more sandbox experiments across the country, we will be able to bring in more innovators and entrepreneurs in the social entrepreneurship space. Uh, this is this is one of the finest examples of promoting entrepreneurship in the country and I hope we can work in collaboration with this Pande Foundation and take it forward. From, a, from the social alpha point of view, our focus is on science and technology based startups for social impact and I think working together we can use Sandbox as the best place to experiment with our pilots, with prototypes and pilots in, in sandbox and uh, you know I, I, I don't think anywhere in the country we can get such a fine uh, uh, experiment uh, uh, you know infrastructure uh, and, and uh, capability among the people. I think the biggest takeaway from this development dialogue is that there is a younger generation in the country which is really looking forward to take ownership of development action on the ground and there are people who are willing to provide that support. I think what we need to make sure that people who are willing to sponsor development and people who are actually willing to execute on the ground, they have a platform to meet each other, to talk to each other and, and to create solutions together. I think the one thing that strikes me most is there are different people who who are trying to solve India's development sector problems and this dialogue is the first step to create collaborative partnerships among these people so that the impact can be magnified and amplified. Development dialogue to me is an ecosystem enabler, a platform where we can bring in all stakeholders together to amplify the impact.